Most people with retinitis pigmentosa are told the same heartbreaking line. There's nothing that can be done. But that's not the full story, and actually is one of the reasons why I started doing what I do. I'm Dr. Andy Rosenfarb. I want to tell you a little bit about RP and what you can do. Now, often, RP is genetic. Sometimes it's not. What I mean by that is maybe you've been told that you have retinitis pigmentosa and it's genetic, but maybe they haven't been able to find any gene associated with your condition. Maybe there simply isn't anybody in your family who has had a history of retinitis pigmentosa. So what then? What we found is that not only is it treatable, not curable, because in my experience, it's often rooted in autoimmune pathology, meaning the immune system attacks the specific rod cells in the retina, breaking them down, causing dysregulation and dysfunction, inflammatory processes, and overall progressive vision decline, including night vision issues, a peripheral vision, not able to see very clear up, up high or down low, that's your visual field start to decline. World starts to closing in and we see tunnel vision. So also going outside to inside, we call dark adaptation. Right? That can be a problem for people in grayscale colors can also be an issue. So this is what it looks like, and there is no current conventional treatment. That's right, so you go to a retinal specialist or your ophthalmologist and you're diagnosed with her, and there's told of nothing that can be done. It's pretty disheartening, and there's talk of maybe stem cell therapy, maybe gene therapy, those are in research, but until then, what do you do? The goal is to help preserve your vision, even improve vision if possible. So our treatment methods here at AccuVision Recovery include different safe, natural, holistic treatment methods, which not only uncover the underlying causes of your eye and manage them, as well as helping you recover lost vision and helping you keep what you got. So if you're interested in learning more about possible treatments for retinitis pigmentosa, what you can do, or maybe a family member or a friend who's dealing with have them reach out to us so we can have a conversation to find out if or how we might be able to help them. This is the best that's offered currently for work with thousands of people from over 50 different countries over the last 30 years. And there is without question things that can be done to again, both recover and preserve vision as it relates to retinitis pigmentosa. See you soon.